Okay, for this one here, the population of a city was 193,000 in 1980, and, and it decreased each year uh, by about 6,000 6, each year since then. Okay. So, in that first year, in that first year, mm -hmm. we let t equal zero for that first year. Okay, the, their initial salary, the population was one ninety three. Okay, and it decreased, so that'll be negative there. And it decreased by a particular amount, by 6,000 per year. And since this is the first year, it's going to be zero. which gives the initial year population to be 193. Then one year later, let's say t equal to 1. It's the second year. Okay. That initial salary, that initial population is 193. And it decreased by 6,000. And this is one year later. So I'll put a one year. Which will give me uh, 193 minus 6 is 187. So it went down. So let's let t equal to 2. This should be our third year. One year, two year, three year there. Start up at one ninety three. Decrease by this is referenced in the first year. So we enter that one now, so zero, one, t equals two. So we're looking at two years after the initial year. Which will make it 181,000. So for t being any year, So for t being any year, we're going to have 193, and this will be decreasing by 6, times t being any year. Well, t could be any year. Okay. So the correct answer is going to be So this is for oh heck. There. Let's call this part A.
and this is the answer to part A. And part B comes next. So they want us to evaluate the expression for t equal 22. So we have 193 minus 6t, and they let t equal to 22. which gives me 61 thousands. Well, let me fix that. Okay. So the answer that it gives here is 61. And that answer here is going to be, rep that represents thousands. So we're looking at therefore I'll be.